My name is Kevin Rigall, and I'm the head carpenter from the, on the production team at Cal Performances. My primary responsibilities are to prepare for any show that we have in this building, in the, uh, in the Playhouse, at Hertz Hall, or in any of our other theaters, anything related to the, uh, the carpentry, scenic, properties elements of a show. I guess this is pretty involved because we have such a variety of things happening at Cal Performances, right? So like every day is pretty different. Every day is absolutely different. Yeah. No, no two shows are the same. Uh, even if we may have two recitals back to back, they're not both gonna be the same thing. So something is always gonna be changing, whether it's we have a piano for one and then we have four chairs and a quartet for the next day. So all of that, the piano is gonna go away and we're gonna bring out chairs and music stands and relight everything for that next show. So do pianists bring their own pianos? Nope, we have three grand pianos in the house that we use. Uh, we have a primary piano, that our newest piano that we use for most classical type recitals. Mm -hmm. And then we have two other pianos, one for that's more kind of tailored towards jazz shows, mm -hmm. and then a third piano for smaller uh, student groups, anyone who might not need anything super fancy. Okay, so Kevin, tell us a little bit about yourself before you ended up here at Cal Performances. Uh, I have been doing theater for about 15 years. I started doing theater in middle school. I moved into the technical side of theater uh, in high school. I went to the University of Northern Colorado where I got my degree, uh, my Bachelor of Arts in uh, technical direction. I then went out and toured for about eight years with a whole number of different Broadway tours. And then I came here in uh, 2019, uh, 2018, and I've been here for just under four years now. Wow, so what do you learn when you're doing a degree like that? Anything and everything to the, to the theater world, technically. I had to do, take classes in lighting, in sound, in costume design, costume technology, scenic construction, computer-aided drafting, wow. and then just the, all the practical running shows that we would do at our university. So this is a two-part question. What's the most exciting part of your job? And what's the most challenging part of your job? The variety. Having different shows come in every week, it's, it's a lot of fun because we get to see and experience so many different things. But at the same time, because of that variety, and that means we have to change things so often that it can, be, it, can become a little, it can become a little tiresome to constantly move the same things back and forth. But that's the industry we live in and that's why we do what we do because the arts is, we wouldn't, be, we wouldn't enjoy life without the arts. Can you talk about that a little more? Like, why do you like working in the performing arts? What, what feels um, rewarding about it? The arts, theater, music, Broadway, dance, all of those things, they, they allow someone to escape reality for an hour, two hours, whatever it is. They come, they watch some other world and they can forget about life and some of those some of those experiences can be uplifting and super fun others can be a little more serious and thought invoking but either way it takes someone out of their daily life for a few hours which can be extremely refreshing to those people who don't get to do that very often totally it it makes all the chair moving worth it right it does. <laughs>
uh, over performers, over technicians' heads, that if people aren't paying attention, it's the easiest way to get hit by something in the theater. Kevin, we are going to do a rapid fire question round. Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, the first question is, what performance are you most looking forward to in the 22-23 season? Everyone's favorite at Zellerbach, uh, Alvin Ailey. Amazing, why do you love them? Because their crew is great to work with and their shows are always gorgeous. Totally agree. Okay, hometown? Uh, Lone Tree, Colorado. Wow, amazing. Favorite food? Spaghetti. Would you rather read a book or watch a movie? Watch a movie. Do you have a favorite movie? Harry Potter series. Oh, good, good. Um, favorite place in the Bay Area? Jack London Square. Nice. Dogs or cats? Cats. Favorite color? Dark red. Cookie or cake? Depends on the, depends on the cookie, but cookies. <laughs> okay, great. And the toughest one is last. Music, dance, or theater? Musical theater. <laughs> Perfect. Thanks, Kevin. We had so much fun. You're very welcome. It was fun to do this. Thank you.